After eight games in the 94th season of the NCAA Juniors Basketball Tournament, College of St. Benald LaSalle Greenhills has already left no doubt that it is the team to beat. The Junior Blazers presented another evidence why on Friday at the Phil Oil Flying V Center as the backcourt of Joel Kagiolangan and Joshua David was an unstoppable force all over and Inan Fornilos was an immovable object down low in their 74-66 victory versus Arellano High School. Kagiolangan did his thing in stuffing the stat sheet with 14 points, 5 assists, and 3 rebounds while David was yet again his partner in crime with his own 14 markers, 5 boards, and 4 dimes. However, it was Fornilos who proved to be a problem in the ear lie going and pounding in all of his 8 points and 9 of his 12 rebounds in the first half. He may not have played much in the second half, but in and gave us the boost we needed at the start, head coach Marvin Bienvenida said. On the shoulders of their second year forward, CSBLSGH got off to a strong 18-5 start and even had a 20-point lead, 47-27, near the end of the second half. Strong starts are important in every game. We're happy we got that today and that helped us win, even though our Elano adjusted, as expected, in the second half, Coach Marvin said. Of course, the Braves kept coming and battled back to as close as 5, 62-67, under the last two minutes, only to see David nail a corner three to keep them at bay once and for all. The latest win is the sixth win in a row and seventh overall in eight games for the Junior Blazers. Suddenly slumping University of Perpetual Help is all that remains in their schedule. They would claim the top spot after the first round with another win there. Oh, on the other hand, after a 3 0 start to the season, Arellano has now lost three of its last four. Ray Domingo fronted the effort for them with 13 points as Ram Junse, Lars Sunga, and Marlon Esperitu all struggled with a combined 33 points in 13 of 35 shooting and seven turnovers. Aaron Furman also fell short of his high standards and only had 9 points and 14 rebounds in this one. Meanwhile, Jose Rizal High School willed its way into solo third after weathering the storm brought about by Emilio Aguinaldo College, 74-69. John Amores, the frontrunner for most improved player, tallied 21 points, 8 rebounds, and 5 assists, and was backstopped by John Dilo Santos who had 17 markers, 8 boards, and 4 dimes of his own. Before the two Johns, the Light Bombers overcame a terrible day from the free throw line, going 13 of 30, to improve to 5-3, leaping over 4-3 RL Ano and University and perpetual help in 3-3 San Beda High School. For the 1-7 Brigadiers, Jay Bodo topped the scoring column with 21 points to go along with 10 rebounds. Box scores. First game. CSBLSGH 74, Kagulangan 14, David 14, Kalamag 10, Sangko 10, Palencia 10, Fornilos 8, Nativitid 6, Morales 2, Lao 0, Cortez 0. Arellano 66, Domingo 13, Jonse 12, Sungo 11, Esperitu 10, Furman 9, Fornis 4, Templin Wave 03, Tolentino 2, Nepomis N02, Liangco 0, Sahali 0, Canyons 0, Recto 0. Quarter score is 22 16, 47 29. 58-46, 74-66.2nd game.jru74, Amores 21, Dilo Santos 17, Bucoy 14, Vasquez 8, Dionisio 6, Balayat 5, Gannett 3, Portales 0, Hickman 0, Fortuna 0, Buno 0. Eek 69, Bodo 21, Ilustrissimo 17, 
Pasquale 11, Sinosa 6, Lozano 4, Beloa 2, Sumagase 2, Insula 2, Quebral 2, Rivera 2, Murillo 0, Mejia 0. Quarter scores 21 22, 33 30, 57 45, 74 69.